Hi guys, I hope you're good. It's that time of the year again. It's the event that we've all been looking forward to. It is the annual Boat Tubers Barbecue. And I have volunteered to host this year. Got some great food and drinking. And all I need to do now is start the barbecue and wait for the guests to arrive. I considered hosting it on the park, but it was a little bit too busy up there. So I decided to have it on my boat instead. It's a beautiful day. The weather's been very kind to us. I absolutely cannot wait to see everybody. I've got the barbecue going. I've got chairs and everything set up for people. And before long, other boat tubers start to arrive. Hello. Hey, thanks for coming. How are you? Oh, thanks for inviting me. I'm really well, what a beautiful day. Yeah, I'm glad you can make it at such short notice. Well, you know, we like to do these things every year. A bit of a get together, a bit of a barbecue. Wouldn't miss it for the world. Ah, uh, I hope you didn't have too much on. Well, you know, I'm a busy man. Lots in my diary, but always going to uh, make sure I can come along to one of your events. They are legendary. <laughs> they are indeed. What's been your favourite thing about the day so far? Just the good weather, actually. Just lounging about in the good weather, in amongst all my busy stuff that I've been doing. I've managed to do a little bit of um, painting on the boat roof, and I've managed to feed the ducks, and yeah, that's about it, I think. I've done my engine bay, as you've seen. I've seen, it's very impressive. Thank you. I need to do a bit of painting inside now because all that dust has uh, made my walls very dirty. So what have you got on the barbecue for us then? Got a bit of pasta here, got some burgers going, some sausages. Yeah, you know, normal barbecue stuff. Cool. Ketchup? Of course, yeah. It was a really chilled out day. We played some games, played on our phones. I started off the food and then left David in charge of the barbecue whilst I went to go and mingle. Hey you, thanks for coming. Oh, thanks for inviting me. I feel um, massively privileged to be honest. You having a good time so far? I'm really enjoying it. Um, I've had such a laugh. Just meeting everyone has been absolutely brilliant and some of the stories you know, I can't, I can't repeat them to be honest. Have you had something to eat? Yep, I've eaten. I've had a couple of hot dogs. The only thing I'd say is, don't leave David in charge of that barbecue much longer. Because, you know, some of them are a bit, vegetarian ones are a bit overdone, I think. That's good. Have you introduced yourself to everybody? Yeah, I've spoken to everyone. I've still got to talk to a couple of people because they're chatting. But uh, but yeah, it's been absolutely hilarious. Um, and just seeing people in the flesh has been brilliant. What about Maeve? Is she having a good time? Oh, Maeve's loving it. She's just loving having a run around and running up to everyone and trying to nick their food. <laughs> so uh, she'll be tired tonight. As well as Maeve, we also had some feline guests drop in. I think they heard that in true barbecue fashion, we ended up having to cook some things on the hob. Hey, nice of you to join us. Thanks for the invite. Good to be here. Yeah, nice to see you. How's your day been so far? <laughs> Pretty good. Um, we've been really lucky with the weather, so. Just enjoying yeah. the time, really. How's the food? 
Good, yeah. Did you manage to get some? Um, we'll get some in a minute, I think. Yeah, once we can get George under control. Yeah, he's looking for any leftovers you can possibly find, and his ball, of course. I've got to keep an eye on him every once in a while. Like a biscuit, George. <laughs> No doubt he'll be in the water soon. <laughs> and then, better late than never, my final guest arrived. Ahoy! Thank you so much for hosting this party, Lorna. You having a good day? I'm having a wonderful day. The weather is perfect for it. They must have known it was the boat she was barbecued. Indeed. You had a great time, you've been mingling with all the guests. Oh yeah, I've had a chat with absolutely everyone. And it's very generous for you to be hosting a second boat to this barbecue so soon after the last one, which was a boring success also. Yeah, well, we went to Ed last year, didn't we? Yeah, but it was the year before that? Mine was the year before that, yeah. Oh, I enjoyed it so much, but I thought I'd do it again. So what's been your highlight long now of today? Oh, there's just been too many highlights. I can't narrow it down to one. Maybe seeing David have another go at karaoke, that was quite good. <coughs> or Jasmine recreating her swim from the other day. <laughs> but probably when George uh, went off chasing someone. That was quite good. We did get um, untied from our mooring just down Sorry, <laughs> we did to get tied, untied from our mooring. Hello. Mm -hmm. um, the other week, so that was annoying because it was 11 o'clock at night and I had my headphones in so I couldn't hear anything. Michael was fast asleep and then I just felt the boat like do a like a, like a one rock thing. And they, they hadn't just untied us, they pushed us off, so that's what I felt. And then for some reason, since we came onto the, onto the Chesterfield, all the pubs have been closed. Pirates. I don't know, Jasmine. Why are pirates called pirates? Because they are. Well, I was I was planning to go out. Um, possibly head up north, but you know, plans change. They do, yeah. I had some really interesting boat plans as well, but they've changed too. Well, now you've got a, a nice clean engine, it'd be a shame to get it dirty by actually going anywhere. That's very good logic, actually. The rest of the day passed with more games, more food, good company, but before long we were all exhausted. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed that. I will see you all again very, very soon. Bye for now. Cheers! Cheers! Mm -hmm.